Now, th this is a question that we rarely think about, but what if tomorrow were to begin without you? Uh, what would that look like for your family? That's right. September's Life Insurance Awareness Month, and we are joined by Tony Beachler of the Beachler Agency to learn more about what we should be doing to ensure our family is taken care of. Good morning to you, Tony. Well, good morning, and uh, Todd, I, it's funny because that's the question that's going to start off right off the bat is, you know, what happens if tomorrow never comes? Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, thank you for having me. Um, it's, it's, it's a privilege, it's a joy. Life Insurance Awareness Month is happening right now in the month of September. And um, I try to do my job and do my due diligence for families and for people that are out there just to make sure that they're protected in their very worst day. Well, it really is a thought-provoking question. So is that something that you directly ask people that you may talk to? Like, hey, let's think about what it looks like if you're not there tomorrow and your family still is, what that looks like. How do you approach that with, with your clients? Yeah, absolutely, and that's a great question. It's very easy for me. I, as a past recruiter, um, one of my go-to questions is, please tell me the life insurance that you have outside of work. Because I think a lot of people and a lot of uh, individuals that have just work life insurance think that they have coverage forever. Um, but I talk to them, well, what happens if you get downsized, right sized, let go, or you leave the company, you no longer have work life insurance. So it's very important, the younger you are, the healthier you are, to get a quote uh, with a term life policy as soon as you can, because then that can give you and your family coverage 10 years, 20 years, 30 years uh, from today's date. Absolutely, and, and let's talk about the process of all of this. The very simple process? It is, and it's, it's simpler, and I think Farm Bureau has done a wonderful job of making it simpler for families due to even with COVID here. Uh, we have a trans entity that's uh, through, that's called the right life process, where if healthy, there's no phone screen, no physical, and you can get coverage of five, up to $500,000 of term life policy uh, without a physical or somebody coming into your home or one of those 20 minute phone screens uh, going through a litany of your of your past and your health. So we have that now, all it takes is a conversation with somebody like myself. Um, I will ask a few questions, we do an e-app and then through DocuSign, you guys could have instant coverage tomorrow or the next day. Interesting. Wow, something that can happen instantly. And as you just mentioned, there isn't a, that's, I think it's a detriment to a lot of people who wanna get this type of life insurance is that that doctor's appointment, all the screenings and all the tests. And you're saying that, that people don't have to do that. Yeah, it's very easy and it's very painless. Um, I, I think people all also have a, a thought process that life insurance costs more than what they can afford. But I always ask people like, okay, if you go get Starbucks every day and it's five bucks a day, you know, life insurance could be as little as, you know, $12 a month. So it can be more than that, but that's, that's what I try to tell individuals and families, uh, you know, that, that have a budget. The other thing I like to say is, you know, if you're making $50,000 and you and your mind are gonna work another 20 years, that's a million dollars of lost income that your family won't have if something happens to you tonight, next week, next month. So I try to put it in that perspective. It's not about what number I think you guys should have, it's really what's best and what works with family with the numbers that you currently have now or in the future that you're building with your family if there's an untimely death. All right, and speaking of health, there's an upcoming event, uh, The Real Men Wear Pink for Breast Cancer Awareness. Yes, well, it's, it's Real Men Wear Pink, as you can see right here. <laughs> um, it's with the American Cancer Society. I'm so excited to be a part of this. Um, and, and it's such a great segue from Life Insurance Awareness Month right to Breast Cancer Awareness Month in October. So uh, I'm very excited to be partnering with uh, the American Cancer Society and also the Wealthy Street Theater because we, I'm, I'm, I'm within a day or two of announcing a big event that we're gonna have with them coming up on October 10th. And it's all about getting the community involved. It's about creating awareness. It's about education of breast cancer and really then ultimately life insurance. Because my job, like I said, is making sure that the families that that I ensure that in their worst day that they're taken care of, whether it's home, home insurance, auto insurance, 
or really then, most importantly, their life insurance. Well, sounds like we got a little tease of something big coming down the pipe. We'll have to see you again, Tony. Thanks for the time this morning, though, and all the great information. Again, September is Life Insurance Awareness Month. You want to learn more, the Beachler Agency right there, uh, covering auto, home, life, business, lake, estate. They do it all. You can call them at 616-318-8167. All right, and coming up on